The defenses of the Bock, Luxembourg City held out against a 1794 seven-month siege by the French during that country's revolutionary wars. Its walls were still unbreached when the garrison finally did surrender. That led the French to respectfully call it the Gibraltar of the North. 6. The Congress of Vienna declared Luxembourg to be a Grand Duchy in 1815 and gave it to the Netherlands. Belgium gained more than half its physical territory in 1839 but Luxembourg gained more autonomy over its own affairs. The country became fully independent in 1867. 7. The Treaty of London in 1867 ended the fights over the sovereignty of Luxembourg. The country has such a strategic location it is known as the heart of Europe. Its fortifications were to be desolated as a condition of the treaty. Today the castle ruins and its underground galleries and passages are Luxembourg's major tourist attraction. Le Boc today is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. 8. The Ardennes is a region of steep-sided valleys carved by beautiful rivers and covered in dense forests. Its strategic position made it a battleground over the centuries between European powers and nations seeking to control its position and resources. 9. During the World Wars, the Ardennes was thought to be impenetrable for military traffic and troops and therefore was not well defended. Germany took a gamble and safely used the area as an invasion route into France during World War I. The Battle of the Ardennes was the result in August 1914 during World War I. 10. Germany successfully gambled again during World War II they could move troops and machines successfully through this almost undefended area, so they used it twice as a route into southern Belgium and northern France. Many of the region's towns suffered great damage during the Battle of France, 1940, and the Battle of the Bulge, 1944-45. 11. Luxembourg offers Europe's highest minimum legal salary, second in the world only to Australia. This means workers are paid a minimum of E1923 monthly. It also has one of the highest costs of living as well. The Luxembourg people have lots of opportunities to enjoy their money and their free time. The country offers a truly affluent European lifestyle. And their average unemployment rate has been the lowest in Europe for over 40 years. 12. Almost half of the country's workforce lives in another country and commutes to work in Luxembourg. They come from France, Belgium and Germany. Luxembourg residents benefit from the fact that its government spends a third of its revenue on universal health care and social services for their people. 13. One of the world's major business and financial centers, Luxembourg is home to over 150 banks including the European Investment Bank. These banks draw many investments from major companies in other countries, including the United States. 14. The country's banking secrecy laws have made it a tax haven but recent reforms are increasing transparency. 15. Luxembourg is ranked by the Heritage Foundation as Europe's first and the world's fourth ranked country for economic freedom. 16. Skype has its headquarters in Luxembourg. PayPal, Amazon, Rovi Corporation, and Rakuten all have their European headquarters there. 17. Luxembourg founded the European Union to create a politically stronger Europe. The highest court in the EU in matters of union law with its 28 justices, one for each member state, is located in Luxembourg. 18. Luxembourg is also is one of the founder nation members of the Western European Union, the United Nations, the Benelux, and NATO. 19. With 54 television channels and 29 radio stations offered worldwide, Radio Television Luxembourg, RTL, Group is the largest television production and radio company in Europe. 20. With 647 cars purchased per 1,000 people, Luxembourg has the highest rate of car ownership in the entire world. What is the top-selling brand? Volkswagen is purchased most often. 21. Over half of the permanent residents of Luxembourg are natives and just under half of them are foreign-born. There are about 170 different nationalities calling Luxembourg home, the majority of the immigrants are Portuguese, over 15%. The country also has very small Jewish and Romani, Gypsy, populations. 22. Luxembourg's population is generally trilingual. The national language, Luxembourgish, is taught in nursery school and spoken at home and among natives. In fact, the major symbol of social class divisions is which language is understood and spoken in the home. German is the first new language taught at school and French and English are taught in secondary school. All three are spoken in public and French, German and English used to do business. 23. The country's motto is, Mir Vela live, war mir essen, we want to remain what we are. This refers to the wish to remain independent after the centuries of battles with other countries over their autonomy. 
2024, Prime Minister Xavier Bettel was the first leader of a country in the EU to marry someone of the same sex when he married Gauthier Distanay in 2015. Luxembourg approved same-sex marriage the previous year with the support of 83% of the population, the country is secular with no national religion although 87% of the people are practicing Roman Catholics. 25. The country is divided into four geographical and cultural regions. Essling is the northernmost one-third portion, and eastern part of the Ardennes forest if the country. The Ardennes mountain range and Moselle and Meuse river basins form the Ardennes forest. The mid-country Moselle River Valley hillsides are covered with Riesling vineyards in terraces. The Gutland, Goodland, is in the south. This is where the more metropolitan areas are and around 85% of the population lives. 26. Specialties in Luxembourg's cuisine include Thuringer, small sausages, Gruper Kieselsch, potato pancakes, Quetcher tort, plum tart, Fritscher de la Moselle, petite river fish that are deep fried, cash caisse, soft melted cheese, jugged hare, Ardennes ham, and Judd Matt Gardebonen, smoked collar of pork with broad beans with Diekirch beer. 27. The cuisine is heavily influenced by French and German cuisine, with more recent influences from their Italian and Portuguese immigrants. Special dishes are eaten on Sunday afternoons, religious and national holidays. 28. Boon Schlup is Luxembourg's national dish and is a medley of green bean soup with potatoes, bacon and onions. Plum brandies from yellow and purple plums are another specialty of the country. 29. Luxembourg is a grand duchy ruled by a grand duke and its parliament, the only one in the world. Their monarch's birthday is the most important and largest single celebration annually. Once celebrated on late Grand Duchess Charlotte's actual birthday in the month of January, it was changed in 1962 to the month of June to gain good weather for the event. The current Grand Duke is Henry. 30. More Luxembourgers turn out to vote than any other citizens of other European countries. 91% voted in recent elections. Hope you like this video. Please like and share this video and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. Thanks for watching.